abrupt start because I forgot to do the loading in screen. Fuck. We're trying the nerf xenomorph. But now I can kill people because, you know, reasons. It's been nerfed. It's probably fair now. See what the missed tail attack feels like. Or the hit tail attack. Because I won't miss. Heh. Alright, what am I? Oh, area of crows. Agony. Yeah, someone brought an offering for area of crows. Makes me very sad. But I can kill now, so, you know, I won't feel too bad. Nothing? Nothing? Something. Yeah, it still feels fairly strong, just probably not that strong. For me. Mm, basement's here. Okay. that one okay Feels bad, but it's not terrible. All right, where the fuck did she go? I'm blind. check these further gems. Oh, man. Hi. I can't just have one you, you know? again.
Actually, it was kind of bad. I'm not gonna lie. him to dodge. Maybe I shouldn't. She's just getting stuck all the fucking time. Tell still good. Turrets are still worth using. Definitely. That one. That one could be the being done. Yeah, it almost certainly is. Uh, not massively. Don't know why they're running. Let me see if I can pressure this one as well. Might as well. Is it being done? Not really. Hiding somewhere. I'm going to double check that one because that was the one Cordell was doing. She's scary. Oh, Adam. Adam's not scary. Adam is not scary. Claudette was looping me pretty well. I don't know why they're not using turrets. Turrets should... Like, turrets are actually really good against NNL. 
They should be, uh... They should be putting them out when they can. I, I've seen one throw this game, I think. Double check this, but... Oh, two turrets. Well, I missed. Where did she go? Over here somewhere? Doesn't really matter. I can go over that, you know. Yeah, you see, she's playing around the tail. So her dodging from side to side like that just lets me get distance. But if she doesn't dodge from side to side and I go for the tail, it's good for me anyway, because she just goes down. Right, if she's predictable, I can just get her. If she's unpredictable, I just end one her. Mm. But if I do miss the tail, it's punishing. Where are you, Adam? See, that was predictable. So I, so I got him. Right. And now I've got Claudette and Yui. I mean, I'm not doing particularly well with the tails. I mean, they chose this map. Hello. Uh, sorry. Zen has been nerfed. I think he's he's in much fairer place now. <laughs> Plus, someone sent me to this map. <laughs> Fuck that. I hate this map so much. I mean, Claudette can get Hatch. She played pretty well. Don't really mind if she gets it. I mean, if I find it, then I might just give it to her anyway. Um, no, it knocks me out of my power, so I can't use my tail whip anymore. Um, but I can destroy it. So, before they nerfed him, I could hit the turret and it, you'd get almost no distance. But now, because of the nerf, whenever I use my tail, I get slowed a lot more. Um, so it gives you a lot of distance. And if I miss, it gives you a lot of distance and knocks me out of my power. So, you know, it's pretty good. I forgot to say GG. Damn it. Well, I'll remember next time. But no, because the so the power now it's always had like a three second recovery, but um, before I ran at like two meters per second while I was recovering, which is like half the speed of a survivor. So you know you'd get a bit of distance, but um, overall it's like what six meters difference you make. 
it's not huge. Now I run at 1.2, so you make like seven or eight meters distant. So it's a fair, dif fair difference, especially considering my tail whip is like, what, three and a bit meters, something like that. I don't know. I just feel like uh, if the turrets are... If, if you're using the turrets as you get them, it's very difficult for me to get hooks. Because I've basically got to just run you down as an M1. Either that or just give up chase and get my power back. Hello. Yeah, not much. An envelope. Moderate. Okay. They're increasing look. Sure. <laughs> yes, I am. Okay. What well, other tunnels you can detect survivors? Thank you. Thank you for these tips. Yeah, I think uh, I think with the tail whip nerfs, he's probably okay now. Like before, I felt like he was a bit oppressive. Now, now he's just good, <laughs> rather than stupid good. Um, honestly, not actually that long. A couple of months. Like two months? Maybe three months? Oh, nice. You fairly new to it too. Yeah, I mean, I had a bit of uh, time, so I just sort of picked it up because a friend was playing it, and then kind of got hooked. Thanks. Um, do, do, do. Wait, what was that? There? Oh, that was the one I was heading to. Lame. Yeah, my first game was a bit of a warm-up. I'm getting used to the uh, tail again. I am 34. I am old. Uh, 
This one. Okay. Alright, where? Hello? Wait, where the fuck did she go? I'm so confused. Oh, she got lucky break or something. Yeah, I try, like, honestly, um, oh, thank you. Uh, ever since I started streaming, uh, I've done a lot better at keeping myself calm with this game. Oh, GG. Wait, were you in our last game? Yeah, it's just a hobby. It's like, uh, it's something I just, I literally just threw it on. Um, partly because some of my friends wanted to watch me play, and partly because, I don't know, I just wanted something to do in the meantime. Like, just playing the game is boring. Like, especially if you're playing killer on your own. But talking to Dream Chat, it's kind of fun. So yeah, it's uh, it's just something I do. Um, it also lets me. Uh, uh huh, uh huh. And you want to sell me some art? Uh, I'm not really interested. Thank you. Sad. Lucky break? No? I mean, if you want to make something cool, go ahead, but I'm not interested in buying anything. Like I say, this is just RB. I just throw it on for... I don't know. Just something uh, to relax. It's not like a full-time job or anything. It's just not something that I need. Let me put it this way, if I said yes to every person that came into my stream and said I want to sell you art, I would be on a tight budget. <laughs> yeah, accidental vault. It's terrible. Now, I don't really want to camp the hooks, but I don't think they're doing any gens. I mean, if you're a professional digital artist, right, surely you have a website. So if I want your art, I'll go there and buy it.
but uh, if you don't stop talking about charging me for your art, I'm just going to ban you. Okay? I said I'm not interested, and that's it. Yeah, accidental vaults are a pain. Like, I swear you have to, like, look away from the vault or something to not do it. I don't know why it prioritizes vaults over picking someone up, but there you go. I'm just looking for the hatch so I can give Leon the hatch, by the way. He's on his last hook already, so... Eh. Oh, good luck with your website. I'm still not interested in your art. Oh, GG's. Uh -huh. <gasps> Was gonna... Look, Shizune, um, Sama, I've already said, I'm not interested. You've not stopped, even though I've told you to. Just leave. Alright. Goodbye. That was a lot of medkits. Whew. Spicy. Yeah, I am feeling a bit better about Xenomorph. He feels fairer. Right. Like, when I miss the tails, it feels pretty punishing, but it just makes hitting them feel all that much better. <laughs> what do you mean, oop? Like OP or I mean he still feels strong, definitely, but better than he was. <laughs> yeah, some of the skins are pretty nice.
Right, where are we going? We need to get ourselves underground. I went underground. That was stupid. Oh well. Hello. Upstairs? Yeah. Vault. Yep. Predictable. Yep. Uh, no basement there. Okay. I'm going to double check these gems down here because these are very good to hold if I can. No. This one's being done. Oh, they're going to be so sad. Get popped. Not in shack, okay. That's very odd pattern. Oh, hello. Oh, Ripley. Yeah, yeah. I think you were in my last match. On the... Uh, what was it? Rotten Fields? Something. No, it wasn't Rotten Fields. Was it? Uh, I can't remember. The, the farm one. Yeah, I'm trying out Xenomorph after the nerfs. I think... Uh, yeah. It seems a lot fairer than it was. So, you know, that's good. Sir, why did you not heal? <sighs> Mercy. Mercy. Yeah, I think uh, after the nerf, like, when I was playing it before the nerf, I just let everyone go. Because I thought it was unfair. But now, I think with the nerf, he's pretty fair, so I'm killing people. I think he's still strong, but he's not. Where were they? I heard them. I swear to God. They're around here somewhere. Am I just blind? Yes, I am. Wait, you mean winning against Zena? Or winning while playing him? A survivor, yeah. That was awkward. Double popping those gems. Yeah, he's... I mean... He's difficult to play against. He really is. Yeah, good luck with your games.
think I've given you enough of a chance. Right? Captain Craig, you're going to need to do a lot of rescuing. Holy shit. And that was not the place you wanted to be. Well, that was awkward. <laughs> I'm sorry, Captain Craig. Oh my god, the base. Okay, he's still strong then. He's still strong. that better than eruption how long I mean it's just when I kick how long does it have to be regressing for that to be equal to eruption uh, generators DVD wiki uh, regressing stats Okay, okay. That's blocked. It slowly loses his charges, survivors have applied. Okay. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Zero point two five charges per second. Okay, so, and people repairing generators are one charge per second, right? Okay. So 10% is like 40 seconds of normal regression. Okay, 10% is quite a lot. Good to know. So 125% of normal would be 0.31, something like that, 
Um, abnormal regression. So 125. So if it's 40, 40 seconds, it'd be 160 seconds for Call of Brian to be the same as Eruption. 160 seconds? What the fuck? If I ain't getting a down in that time, I deserve to lose. Ooh. Big. Strong offering game. These survivors know what they want, and it's not offerings. <laughs> Fair enough. I was trying to work out how long Call of Brian had to be on a generator to be as good as a single eruption proc. Turns out it's 160 seconds. Yeah, I ain't doing that. There's no way. No way I'm using Call of Brian. I suppose it's good for info. But, nah. All right, let's see what we map we're on this time. Okay, Auto Haven. It's a pretty balanced map. Pretty balanced. Which one is it? Gas Haven? It's the shop, isn't it? Yeah, it's the shop. I don't know why I'm walking around. I should be in the tunnels. There's the one anyway. Hi. That's some very odd pathing. We we'll take it. That I was not expecting. <laughs> this Meg just fucking ran at me. I was not expecting that. Oh, there's the, there's the hook. I thought I saw one around here. Right, uh, I'm gonna go into my burrow and listen for generators, because... Nope. Nope. This one. I'm so confused. Okay. You go back in. No, you went around here. <laughs> that was <laughs> that was the wrong click. Okay, <gasps> I was meant to right click. Uh, agony. this loop. Okay. Okay. I see you. I see you, Steve. Mm. Circles. They're confusing. 
Alright, let's uh let's go check some generators again. This one? Question mark. Ooh. Big. Where are you? I don't have my tail, so pre dropping seems Here though. Where the fuck did you get? Sir. Really, sir? This bot before my pop runs out. That was dead hard. This is a dead hard gamer. The fuck. I don't see many of those these days. High tap. I really want. To there we go, Meg. Wait, is this the same Meg? I don't know if this is the same make that I've already hooked. It might be. It is. So it doesn't seem like they've progressed any of the generators. Tap. Wait, are you dead? Am I remembering that right? Yes. Wait the dead hard and then go. Um, he's not struggling. I'll allow him to go to the basement then.
don't know where this other person is. Have they been hiding the entire game? That missed. Is that quick and quiet? You know what? You can escape. You're doing pretty well. I'm going to go and look for this other gamer. Because I'm fairly sure I've not seen this other one. Yeah, I'm I'm looking for this other Meg because I don't think I've seen her the entire game. And I want to make sure she's playing because if she's not, I'm just going to kill her. <laughs> there you are. The fuck? Are you playing the game? <laughs> like... I'm pretty sure... I've not seen this Meg the entire game. Okay, this one's given up as well. Sorry then. <laughs> Who called me ugly? <laughs> oh my god, how dare they! Oh, I feel bad about the tap now. Wow. That was, uh... Is that some salt? Uh, I mean, I understand if you're angry. I was gonna let one of you go, but you just didn't struggle. Hi, Gary. Yeah, I saw. Yeah, GG's. You played well. I think you were dead, trying to dead hard the uh, tail, but you were being very dodgy. <laughs> so I uh, accidentally outweighted the first dead hard, and then I knew it was there. I don't know. It's kind of good. It's just very difficult. Well. I think you get a daily and it's pretty good though, because you can tech now. It's 
just you've got to be some fucking zoom or reaction speed. Yeah, you too. Enjoy your next game. Oh, cheers. So I'm just spending blood points while I decide what I'm going to play next. Probably going to do some more Xenomorph, but... Yeah, sorry, Sushiers. Wait, was it Sushiers? Yeah, the Meg last game. I, I think I was looking for your f other the other Meg, because I hadn't seen her all game and I wanted to make sure she was playing. Um, and then I was going to let you go, but you didn't sh struggle, so I was just like, okay. <laughs> uh, I guess you don't mind then. Uh, so far, I like this one. Um... Another favourite would be Bubba. I really like Bubba. Uh, who else is fun? Nemesis. Nemesis is good. Uh, I kind of like Pinhead, but I'm terrible at him. Yeah, I do play Survivor. But at the moment, there are... Um, blood point bonuses on killer, so. To go against school merchant, easy. Easy question. Next. <laughs> no, I hate school merchant. I hate her with a passion. Yeah, I mean it's uh she's she's a tricky one, right? She's uh <sighs> like I played against one where you know, she was just using her drones in chase, like she was closing off loops and all of that stuff. But and then it was fun to play against. But the way she just puts the drones above generators and sits in camps in three gens until you all die. And it's boring. And I hate it. If you're interested in the killer that I find the most difficult to like run or loop against, I think it's clown. Like, I don't know what it is about clown, but I just cannot get the hang of looping against clown. I don't think I lose that often against Clown, but I, whenever he chases me, I'm just done. I last like 40 seconds and then I'm, yep, I'm on the floor. Uh, Learys. Yeah, it's because someone who's 
got some Twitter following or whatever decided to say they were like saying something about um, playing school merchants like playing chess you just count the three gens and it's like using all of your brain or whatever it was just some meme I heard someone but I don't know where they are now no something hello fire hurts it's very dangerous <laughs> oh uh, yeah it's like some school merchant content creator was like Playing school merchant as a chaser is the incorrect way to play her. Everyone knows that she's just camp three gens. It's uh, it's really weird. Oh yeah, Zeno's interesting. So um, I can show you a few things. So you see his tail, where the point of it is. The hitbox sort of comes down from the top and aims downwards slightly. So it angles downwards. And you can sort of see it with that green outline that I do when I do the tail. Uh, the turrets, if I, they're on me for too long, will knock me out of my power. Now I can't use my tail at all. Right, I'm just an M1 killer. Uh, if I go into my tunnels, I get my t power back faster. Right, but I do get it back slowly even outside of the tunnels. Uh, the nice thing about Xeno, though, is I can right-click or M1, and you don't know which one's coming, right? It's just which one I choose. Right? There's very little indication as to which one I'm going to do. So I can just swing, or I can right-click and do my tail. Like this. So that's what makes him so strong. It's because you can't predict him. Wait, where the... F Flipping lucky break. I swear to God. <laughs> uh, yeah, the tunnels are normally near the generators. But you see these, like, highlighted white things and yellow things. Uh, they're my tunnels. But they go under the map. Uh, they let me travel across really quickly. Uh, I'll show you. So I go under. And I just... Oh, there's a generator. So while you're under here, you can hear the generators. And you can see footprints of people running around. You can hear like cries of pain if they're injured. Hello. Ooh. That was a good stun. So the tunnels are very powerful because it's, it's like a map teleport. Uh, you're about as fast as... Demogorgon? No, not Demogorgon. Maybe Demogorgon? I don't know. No. Who's the, who's the one that's very slow teleporting across the map? Sadako's like instant. Hello. So it's not her. Demogorgon's fairly quick. There's another there's another killer that they compared it to. Um yeah, try and be healed is always a good shout. Like Xenomorph loves injured survivors. Because obviously it's they're just a lot easier to hear. Like, every killer likes injured survivors. Um, no, I'm thinking of someone who can go, like, across the entire map. It might be Sadako. I don't know, to be honest. So, you see, because this survivor's injured, I heard her from miles away. I'm not paying enough attention to this. Uh, it might be Nurse. I, I don't honestly remember. I think uh, I think Xenomorph's about as fast as Demogorgon, but I'm not sure. 
I should really be using my locker power, but I'm forgetful. <laughs> nah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. That's what the stream is for. Wait, did I hit her or the turret? Yeah, so the thing is, if you're holding a turret and I hit you, uh, it blows up the turret. Oh, she's saboing. That's annoying. I saw you, cheeky bastard. I saw you as well. Yeah, I know it's unfair, but you know what? Zeno has been nerfed. I think he's fairly balanced at the moment. <laughs> I've just been practicing too much with him. Yeah, this one can get a kick. This one can get a kick. go down there. So I can also highlight one of the tunnels um, and then it gives me like GPS. Yeah. I, I agree. Like if someone's practiced a lot on Xenomorph I think he should be difficult to beat. And that's what I think MMR is for. Right? Because every killer has its own MMR. So, all of the killers I play, I have a different MMR for every single one of them. Because I'm not as good at some, and I'm better at others. But for survivors, your MMR is the same for all of them. Oh. What was that lag? Uh, so, MMR is matchmaking rating. Which is... A measure of how good you are at the game. I'm sorry, Claudette. That was very obvious. So, MMR is like... It's just a measure of how good I am at a killer. And I get put up against people... Survivors that have a similar... Number. Right? Because then it's a fair game. But because every single killer has a different rating, depending on how well you play that killer, um, like, I might go against really good survivors when I'm playing Xenomorph, and I might go against really bad survivors when I'm playing, like, Hillbilly, because I'm very bad at Hillbilly. just as an example. But for survivors, because all of the survivors are the same, your rating is the same for every single survivor. So if you've got a good rating on one survivor, it's the same rating on all of your survivors. What are you... Claudette, please. Yeah, I mean, if you get good at Legion, you'll go against people who are going to be good, right? Because 
uh, as you get better at Legion, you'll get a higher and higher rating. And then it will match you against survivors that I get better and better and better. Right. The idea is you should win approximately half of your games. Right? Yeah, and it just means that when you first pick up a killer, you might be put up against very new survivors. But if you start beating those survivors very easily, then it will start putting you up against better survivors. Like, my first few games when I was playing Trapper, I played against some survivors that just had no idea. Absolutely no idea in the game. Claudette. Claudette. I'm sorry. Look. I gave you a chance. And you see... I think my rating on Xenomorph is a little bit lower than it should be. Because... I went on... When I first bought him... I went on that streak of just letting everyone go. I hooked everyone twice and then just let everyone go. So... I think... It's a bit unfair for these people at the moment. But I should soon be on a... My proper rating. Hopefully. It's just while he was new, I thought he was a bit unfair, so I didn't want to kill people. I just wanted to practice him. Oh no, I'm getting flamed. And you can see in the bottom left, my tap power is like slowly filling up. And when it's full, I'll just go onto all fours. And now I can tell people. And if I get pulled out of it again, you'll see it start filling up again. Hello? Ow! Got that. So now it's filling up again, because I messed up. I went for the thing instead of... Uh... I don't know. I mean, I could... You can see auras while you're in the tunnel. And you can see footsteps. But uh, you, can, you can't see footsteps if they're crouching. And you can't see footsteps if they're holding a turret. But the thing that was really strong about him was the fact that when you missed with your tail, he was still quick. Right? So if I miss with my tail now, I'll be really slow for like three seconds. Right? But, before, like, like if I miss now, I miss, and I'm slow, 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 slow. Now I'm fast. Right? Before, he was still quite quick when he missed. So survivors couldn't get away. No, there was a cooldown, it was just, it didn't slow me down, right? I, I would still keep up with the survivors. So I missed, and then I'm just keeping up behind them anyway. It didn't matter that I missed. But now if I miss, they can get away a bit. So it matters. So like, if I, if I just miss here... I'm going so slowly for three seconds. Survivors can get a lot of distance in that time. Uh, 
Uh, and I get that same slowdown even if I use my tail to kill a turret. So I want to be using my M1 to kill turrets if I can. Hello? Uh, <laughs> crouching doesn't make him visible. <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's it's really good right so if you dodge a tail attack now it means a lot and if he has to use a tail to kill the turret um it slows him down a lot right the other thing is it is very very difficult if you put a turret out in the open where there's nothing around it he has to use his tail to kill it or have add-ons that help him. Otherwise, he's just going to get knocked out of his power. But, if you put a turret like right next to the corner or something, he can just poke his head around the corner and then just M1 it. He won't get knocked out. No. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, exactly. Use it in between the tiles that you want to loop around to help you get the distance. And if the Zeno ignores them, um, he's just an M1 killer. A trapper without his power. Um, I was not expecting her to be next to me. <laughs> oh my god, she scared me more than I scared her. What the fuck? I made her scream and she just screamed in my ear. I'm like, what? What is this? <sighs> I might play some different killers after this one. Yeah, last survivor. I mean, if they get a hatch, they get a hatch. I'm probably going to give it to the hatch. Because this, uh, this thing has been a baller. I've enjoyed chasing her. If she finds it, then I didn't even have to give it to her. It's just the, the hatch in this map is a pain in the ass to find. Because it can be, like, anywhere. There it is. Hello. Right, where are you? See, now I'll look for her. Because now uh, I know where to take her when I kill her. She's not here. Okay. Where's the other exit? Over here? Wait, where is the other exit? See, what the survivor's doing is they're probably waiting by the exit gates for me to close the hatch. Yeah, I mean... I'm probably going to lose where the hatch is. This, this map is terrible for it. Like, is she around here? No. I, I've 
lost where it is already, honestly. Oh, she found it. Perfect. GG's. I was looking for you to give a hatch. <laughs> uh, no. Not really. Um, the way I see it is if I'm giving them hatch, that's like me... I won, but I let them live, sort of thing, in my mind. But if I... I suppose if I give them exit gate. Like, usually I'll give exit gate if there's someone on their team griefing or AFKing and things like that. I'll usually go for the bit of a point farm and then just let them complete gens and get out. Oh, the Claudette was doing Adept. I feel bad. I'm sorry, Claudette. I didn't know. Oh, agony. That feels bad. Yeah, if there's, like... A survivor that's just like purposely failing skill checks, throwing pallets for no reason, you know, saying get me out of this game, I want to die or whatever. It's like, yeah, it feels bad for the other survivors, right? Because then it's 3v1 and the game's not balanced around that. It's like at least if they DC the bot does something, then it's still kind of a game. I said I was going to do a different killer, didn't I? I lied. Eh, I, uh... I don't know. I'm pretty relaxed about it, to be honest. If they find it, they find it. If they don't, they don't. And depending on how they're behaving sort of in the game, I'll either close the hatch when I find it or I won't. But that, uh, that thing... Yeah, that's fair. I mean, if you're having a bad day, it can make you feel better. You know, go for it. You do you. In the end, it's a game. You uh, you play it to have fun. I normally give hatch to the uh, to someone if they've looped me well, or if it's the last person alive and things like that. But I don't know if they're being assholes like teabagging and shit I'll kill them you know sometimes they're being assholes and teabagging and I can't kill them and then you know they get away but that's life but no the thing was a good sport she played the game. Yeah, she can have hatch. Uh, I mean, body blocking's legitimate. I, I mean, I get it that it's annoying. It's a legitimate thing to do, though. Try and save a teammate. Like, if it's a full Sabo squad, I do play it differently. But, I don't know. I'm not doing it out of spite, if that makes sense. I'm not doing it because I'm annoyed at them. I'm doing it because slugging them is the way you should play it. It is the correct thing to do.
Well, I lost them. That was fast. How did I lose three people? <laughs> like legit, walked out, of, walked into the shack. There were three people there, and I lost them all. Yeah, like full cyber squads are really awkward to play against. You basically have to slug them all and wait for them to bleed out. Or slug them all and then hook them one by one. Yeah. But it's legitimately the correct thing to do. And people will say it's toxic or whatever, but I don't think it is. I think slugging just a normal team. Like, I don't really like doing that. I don't like camping hooks either. Or tunneling people. But, you know, if killers do do that, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. It's just, how badly do they want to win, you know? Wait. I thought that was footsteps. It's a Goddamn fire. Yeah, scatter. Yeah. Yeah. There's a boon? No boon. That seemed like... Wait, have I already hooked? I've already hooked her. That feels real bad. Yeah, I mean, this this fung, I, I just caught her twice. Like, I didn't... I'll try and let her go next time, like, out, of, out of pity, but, you know, uh, that was just unlucky. I've not found anyone else. I should use my alien perk more often, but... I'm really bad at using it. Anyone? Any gamers around here? Anyone want to scream for me? No. Ooh, ooh. One over there. Okay. Hello. That was a Michaela scream. Uh, yeah, I mean, if, if they're body blocking the unhook, like, the, the only times that I will camp a hook, in quotation marks, is if I spot someone, and then during the chase they just run straight to the hook, right? Then I'll try and ignore out the person that they got off the hook, but if they body block, then, you know, well, that was terrible. If they body block, then it's just, you know, game's on, then. You've made yourself a target. Where the fuck did they go? <laughs> it's so... So bad at this game, I swear. But yeah, if if someone literally trails me there, right? At that point, it's on them taking me there, right? Wait, where the fuck? I need to stop looking at chat. <laughs> Too easily distracted. Right, there she is. So the other downside of Alien is this fucking tail is in your way the entire time, I swear to god. Like, oh no, I can't see her. Because the tail's in the way. Oh. 
These guys are doing well though. These guys might escape. I'll have to see. There's someone doing a gen over there. I mean, I've got a nice three gen here, but eh. We'll have to see. Uh, right, where can I go? Where's the last gen? I'm gonna check that one over there. Yeah, they're definitely doing this. Is it Fung, Fung Min, maybe? It is. Look, I'm sorry. I'll give you a freebie. How's that? Actually, no. It's two gens left. I can't afford that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. GPS my way back. Yeah, this one's definitely being done. Oh my god. Well. Kick. Where are you? Over here somewhere? That's close to being done. That's scary. Oh. Aha. Nia, I've not seen you yet. I'm pretty sure. Where the... Oh my god, she is there. That loop's annoying. I'm going to give this a little bit of a kick. Yeah, I don't think she was expecting that. Is that still regressing? Still regressing. Um, that's... No, I don't want you to do that. See, that was because that was a predictable move. It was a very easy hit. The one before was a bit. Ooh, is that sprint burst? See, she's taking me straight back to the hook, so I don't feel bad about going straight back to the hook. Right. But I won't go there on my own. Oh, she juked left. Well played. So that's another thing about the Xenomorph. If he's chasing you at an angle towards the window and you vault it, um, you want to make the angle as sharp as you can. Like, why am I not in chase? Hi. Uh, I don't think she's dead. Right. I think I've hooked... This This girl is going to be on the second hook. And then the other two, I've only done one hook. I'm pretty sure. Where you at? I think they just left. Um, let's give him a scream. Okay. Go over there. That's fine. 
Nia. Hello, Nia. One. Do do do. At least no one's jump scared me this time. Oh, hello. What are you doing at that generator? I do not approve. This is death for her, I think. That was very brave. Kayla was somewhere over here, I think. Honestly, I don't know. She was hiding over here, but... Oh, she's gone for a rescue. Fair play, fair play. This is regressing. I'm going to just double check that generator really far over there. zero progress. I think, yeah, I think I've pretty certainly won now. But one generator, that's, uh, that's pretty good going, right? And they could still split my attention enough that they can do this. I mean, these gens are split. If they know where both of them are, they can definitely do it. I think they have to figure out where the turrets are, though, because I don't think there's any left. Yeah, there's zero turrets left. So, they have to figure out where the turrets are and get them around these generators. I think that's the only way they're going to do it. Oh, they're doing this one. You sneaky fuckers. I thought she was going to go for the pallet save. I mean, the the fact that they doubled this gen while I wasn't paying attention to it, it's pretty, pretty smart. But I think they're pretty dead now. I mean, I'll look for the Nia. Okay, chat. Do I let them go? I think these two have been good sports. I think I let them go. Yeah, I think they've, they've been pretty nice. Yeah, it's easy, okay. You've done well. Go, go, go do your DM. 
Look, I've, I've, I've got to damn them to show them that I mean well. Look, this is what you do. So now, you hold them. You walk up to a hook. And then you go, woo! Going for a spin. And then you hold them next to the gem. I could have hooked you, but I didn't. And now I wait while they finish it. Yeah, I mean, this is the way I sort of communicated it when when I was practicing, I didn't normally pretend I was nice. I was just like, I just pretended that I couldn't quite reach the hook or I was chasing someone else while you got them off the floor sort of thing. But here, I'm, I'm happy to just let them go. Yeah, well, partly that, but partly because I also wanted them to keep running away from me because I still wanted to practice the killer. If they you think I'm friendly, they'll do things like this, which is just stay near me, right? And I don't get to practice anything. GG's. MP. You did well. Right, I said different killer. Who should I play? Oh. Thank you to you too. It was fun. Um, sea Spirit's probably the one I'm best at, but it's also very difficult to play. Yeah. Who should I play? I do like Bubba. Bubba's so much fun. Spirit's one of those killers that it's very difficult to do while looking at chat. You have to pay attention to so many things while you're phasing. Wait, am I not getting a bonus? Angry bubba noises. <laughs> no problem, no problem. You both did well. And chat voted that you said that you should be free.
<laughs> yeah, it was a good game. Oh, I'm glad. Good looking in your next games. Uh, now, there are a few maps that I really don't like as Bubba. Let's see which ones I get. So I really don't like the game. Don't like Haddonfield. And I don't like Leary's. Anything else is fine. Yeah, this one's fine. Okay, we can we can live with this map. Uh, don't have lethal. Okay, there's a scratch mark there. Well, that was a good start. Definitely a good start. Is that two for the basement gang? Oh, alive. No, I wanted to hook you. That was a live play. No. Uh, go here. Oh, I think I lost them. No. Nope. This knee's doing well. Uh, she's a bit screwed here, though. There's no pallets. So hook her here, kick that chair, and see who's around. Yeah, no one around there. I'm gonna kick that gem. Maybe. Someone else over here. Two megs that look exactly the same. Where? She got dance with me? chase
They're doing pretty well with this loot. God. The fucking tree tech. Get a hook nearby. Oh my god, where is a the hook? They're gonna finish that gen, aren't they? You bastards. I wanted that gen. check the gen over here. Fuck. Well, there goes that gen. What gens have I got? Those two and that one. Ugh. That's not going to be easy to hold. Is the last one Shaq? Dad. No. Alright, let's check check these two gens down here. These are both fine. Let's go back to Shack then and make sure that they're not progressing that too far. Oh. Fine. live for a bit. Or not. I mean, if you're going to walk into me, then there's not a lot I can do. Thank <laughs> you. 
How dead are you? Probably not very. Maybe? Oh no, she's dead as well. Okay. Right. I'm going to give these a quick look. Yeah, I'll kick this. And then I'm going to go and pressure the shack. Because they're probably doubling up on it. So I think the Kate is on, not Kate, the uh, Meg is on two hooks and the Nia's on one. And they're not doing this gen at all. Okay. Hi Nia. Where are you going? Are you sneaking on over here? Where are you, my distortion gamer? Where are you, my distortion gamer? Oh, GG. Yeah, I'm I'm on the last two now. I don't think they're doing this one. They are doing this one. Oh Meg. Yeah, sorry, I I don't really like camping the hooks, but um, if you drag me over to them, then I'm going to go there, right? I'm not going to leave just because someone's hooked there. <laughs> so sorry about that. I think this Meg's dead. And I don't mind if Mia gets hatch. She's played pretty well. I think she's got distortion. I, I don't know why else I can't find her. Like, I'm pretty sure she's been near some of the generators that have been... That feels bad. Right, let's go find Nia and give her a hatch. Nia, where are you? Nothing? Okay. Yep. Go for it. GG's. I don't know whether she was teabagging to say, haha, I got you. But I found the hatch a while ago. <laughs> I could have closed it if I wanted to, but GG's. Ah, oh, great progress one. What is this? Hacks. It wasn't distortion. What was up with those scratch marks? Ah, so this Meg did have dance with me. That's what I was thinking. David. Ah, oh, David, you've got some real... Ah, oh, Blood Amber, I see. So you've got some self-care boony stuff going on. I didn't hear any boons. Did you just not find one? Ah, lightweight. That was what was happening with the scratch marks. 
I think low key that lightweight perk is actually pretty good. Like, not even because it makes them more spread out, just the fact that they don't last as long. I think it's actually pretty good. Pretty good. I don't know what I'd use instead of the ones I've got, but... Yeah. I mean, I... By your hand, kill one survivor with a nemesis. I've got a Mori someone with a nemesis. Oh, okay. Well, do I have cakes on Nemesis still? Not many. Do I have any green Mories? Kill one survivor on the second hook state. You know what? Sure. Oh, Mories on one is Nemi. This might be my last game though. I've got to be up tomorrow. Bit of a short stream, but. Oh well, Dems the brakes. Don't be the game. <laughs> Just the game. It's the only thing I don't want. Having 57 pallets is no fun. Right. <sighs> Get tier 2 whip. Kill some survivors. That's my plan. I don't like using a Mori, but it's a quest or a ritual. I have to. It must be done. Area of Crows? Eh, sure. Okay. That was fast. Two. Are you gonna feed me tier two straight away? Yes, you are. That has probably screwed over your team a little bit. Not gonna lie. Right. I look at kicking that gem. There's probably another one with more progress, but hello. No, I meant to charge. Charge. Smash. Okay, that was...
Okay, that gate was a bit oblivious. Let's go back to those gems in the middle and see what's happening. Seen everyone except the Jake. before. I did. You've used a antidote already. Someone down here? Someone's bleeding. Is this Steve? I'm sorry, Steve. I'm not going to go for you. Sorry, Steve. Ah! You were injured. You made it very... I shouldn't have just left my tentacle out there, but, you know. Dems the brakes. So Steve's on second hook. He's probably going to be one more target. Sorry, Steve. No progress, no progress. Maybe one over there. Yeah, this one. That was a good pop. Hi, Jake. That's a bunch. Pretty far. Okay, that's Steve up there. Stop it. You're not allowed. Headset ran out of batteries. Needed to plug it in. Agony. Hi, Meg. Steve, no. My poor sweet summer child. Wait, did I already hook you? I think I did. I don't... R whatever. That feels bad. Well, I'll get over it. Uh, I'm going to kick that gen again. Steve. 
Do I just Mori Steve? Got the quest over and done with. Right. Nah. I think I'm gonna go for the Meg. I think I've not hooked Gabriel yet, right? Interesting. I was expecting her to... Why am I not in chase? There we go. Right. Interesting. I think I've hooked it before. Oh, did they get it? No, they've got a different gem. Interesting. I didn't know they were doing that one. No, I've not hooked her yet. I've not hooked the Gabriel either yet. Hi, Gabriel. I think you're my next target. Not hit. Okay. He's not infected, he's just got a blue outfit. Everyone's infected. Oh, you, my Mori target, then. Feels like you might be. Sorry. One down. Feels kind of bad. Check this gem. Well, at least the daily ritual's done. I guess I'll just do. What's the other one? Wraith. It's like just play Wraith, right? Just play Wraith. That's a easy enough ritual. Honestly, I thought I was going to Mori Steve, but Jake just pre presented an opportunity, so I just took it. I mean, why not at that point? Oh my god. I'm bad at the game. I'm bad at the game. Got body blocked by a zombie. Cause I'm bad at the game. Where are you going? Over there. That's fine. Got that one? Okay. Not done that one at all. Oh, it is Gabriel's second hook. Okay. And that zombie's chasing someone. Two people, apparently. Thank you, zombie. Look, I'm sorry, Steve. I am sorry. But you may 
making a very good target. Unfortunate. Maybe zombie? Oh, zombie. Swing and a miss. Okay, I guess I'll go for the mag. She's, she's actually juicing. Okay, that's not juicing. <laughs> she was juicing. She did well, she did well. She knew what she was doing. Let's kill these other two, and then... Oh my god, we might actually do the generators. I might let the meg go, though. Hi, Steve. Is that Steve? Yeah, goodbye, Steve. I'm sorry, friendo. Had it. Okay. <laughs> Zombie! <laughs> well done, Zombo. still feel bad about killing the Jake. But, you know, things be things. Alright, let's uh let's go kill Gabriel and then let Meg leave. Are they over here somewhere? Maybe. <laughs> Zombie, are you chasing someone? Or are you just walking over here because, you know, it's useless. You get to get whipped. I mean, I'm looking for them. I'm not finding them, but you know, I'm looking. Oh, hello. This Gabriel is also pretty good. Well, they know what to do against Nemesis. Right? They're... They know what to do. Alright, see where the hatch spawns and go get Meg in it. Here's the hatch here. No. Let's check the shack. No. I don't know where the hatch is then. I guess I'll go look and then uh, she might find it first to be honest. You never know. Huh. 
Huh. Where is it then? I'm so confused. <laughs> there should be a hatch. I've got no clue where it is. Absolutely no idea. <laughs> Where is it? I can't find the hatch or Meg. What? Yeah. I mean, I was going to give you a hatch. I was right next to it at the start. Oh well. GG's. Sorry about the Mori daily. <laughs> right, that's probably my last game. Gabriel was nice. Maybe I should have let him go. <laughs> Who knows? Anyway, I'll catch you guys some point in the future, hopefully. And yeah, GG's. I hope you all had fun. <laughs>